You know, just because it makes a mushroom cloud doesn't mean it has to be a mushroom bomb. Good job, Ashley. You're the muscle of this team. I could have used my biotic powers, but whatever. Bomb is in position. We're all set here. Commander, do you read me? Uh-oh. The nuke is almost ready, Lieutenant. Get to the rendezvous point. Negative, Commander. The Geth have us pinned down on the AA tower. We've taken heavy casualties. We'll never make the rendezvous point in time. Can the, can the Normandy just do it? Sending reinforcements. Why is no one gets left behind the renegade answer here? What? I, I want to save him if I can. I figured he would he would die when they're like, you have to choose between these two. Well, shit. But uh, if I can save him, I'm going to do that. I'll pick the neutral answer then, I guess. Yeah. Hold tight. We're coming to get you. Yeah, I'll get you. Just make sure that nuke is set. We'll hold him as long as we can. It's okay, Commander. I need a couple of minutes to finish arming the nuke. Go get them and meet me back here. I'm not sure how I feel about any of this. Yeah, you're coming with me. How about that? Up to the AA tower. Move. What? Crap. All right, so it's going to be Liara and Rex. Yeah, like, sorry. <laughs> Crap. I want... Okay, so I got a level. That's something. I don't feel good about what I've done here, but I got something. Yeah, once again, stasis. It just does not sound good. It does not sound good. I'm up to level 46. I'm also... I'm almost up to max paragon points. That's something. All right, uh, we'll, we'll increase the duration of the lift. If I can ever get that to work. Singularity's maxed. We'll keep going with the lift, I guess. And Rex has a little bit of work to do here. Uh, yeah, stasis still doesn't sound good. Uh, we'll get your shotguns up to there and then start going with throw. I think that is good for now. If you could stop doing that, when I'm fighting Geth, that would be appreciated. Where the hell is this water coming from? I see where it's going, obviously. It's gotta be some kind of cooling tower, really. Yeah, my radar being jammed is not a good sign, to be honest with you, and I don't know where I'm going. So that's fun. It's probably, it's not that way? It's not that way either, apparently. They, they won't let me use the buttons. Is it up here somewhere? Then not, it's not an automatic door. Okay. I don't know if I necessarily want to drop a save at this point, but... You know what? Th those were my instincts. I, I might as well try to stick with them. But seriously, where the hell do I go? Is it is it there where they were kind of pointing me? No, it doesn't seem to be the way either. Is it here? It's here. Okay, yeah, that was, that was hidden. That's not nice. Yeah, might have guessed. You got anything easy? You got guess ghosts. Are you kidding me? Okay, healing. Uh, oh shit, you guys, you guys are doing it. Warlord. Warlord goes down. All right, one heal and we're fine. I got a medjool back somehow. <laughs> we got some inventory out of that. I got a katana. I guess the snow blind isn't bad. I shouldn't need to re-equip. I did check equipment before we left and Rex was doing pretty good. But he seems to be okay. God, nobody can die, okay? Nobody can freaking die. If I can help it. So, Rex, uh, I know she already kind of said no to a threesome, but, you know, it's still on the table. I can, oh, this way. I can, you know, I can talk to her. Yeah, if you're in. He's not in. 
Nobody's in, damn it. Why is nobody in on this? Seriously, who's holding this back? Of course I am. I left with like, I, I didn't count it, right? I, I don't have a way of counting it. Damn. Yeah, they're sending in reinforcements. Chief, we just spotted a troop ship inbound to your location. Thanks, Caden. It's Kaden. already here, and it's bleeding Geth all over the bomb site. No. I'm gonna go back and get Ashley. Once again, they're giving me the choice, Caden or Ashley, and I'm choosing Ashley here. Hold on, Chief. I'm coming back to get you. Negative! It's too late for us! There's just too many of them! I'm activating the nuke! No. What are you doing, Chief? Making sure this bomb goes off, no matter what! It's done, Commander. Go get the Lieutenant and get the hell out of here! Belay that! We can handle ourselves! Go back and get Williams! Okay, now they really are forcing me to make this choice. I've made my choice. Williams, radio Joker and tell him to meet us at the bomb site. Yes, Commander, I... It's the right choice, and you know it, Ash. Just hold on. Stay alive. I'll be coming to get you too, Caden. I think we both know that's not gonna happen, Commander. No, damn it. <sighs> get back to the bomb site. Yeah, we'll see what I can do here. I'm coming back for Ashley, like, given the choice. Would you rather have the person that compliments your class or the person that is your class? I would rather have the person that compliments my class. We'll, we'll go with that because then I don't have to say that it's personality based. It's a business decision. Totally a business decision. Damn it, Ashley's the better character anyway. Sorry, I said it. I like her more. I don't, I don't like Kaden all that much. Plus he's my class and therefore not my favorite. All right, down goes one. Yeah, don't. All right, go for the throw here. Damn. I threw and the singularity went off. All right, uh, we'll get that going. Yeah, lift, lift. Are you kidding me? I stood in front of a rocket after I yelled at my team for doing the same damn thing. All right, auto save it is, I will. I will meet you back here when there's Geth for me to kill. Okay, we should be ready to go. I did actually equip Rex with new armor. He absolutely needed it. And there was something better than what I had on him. All right, down goes the sniper. That guy is easy. Uh, it's these other guys I'm a little concerned about. As long as I stay away from... Uh, As long as I stay away from the corner, I should be fine. Oh shit, he's right here. Oh, there's two of them. There are two of them. Oh, that didn't do shit, did it? Yeah, if you guys could start shooting, that'd be great. We're up against a Geth Prime. I'm going to lift him first. And then I'm gonna get my marksman going. All right, down you go. We got the juggernaut. Can I get him? Got him. Got him. No problem second time around, knowing that they're coming. Makes things a lot easier. I think the Geth Prime, I was told, was one of the toughest things. All right, uh, I think he missed. Can I make a break for it? All right, should be fine here. Here we go.
I applaud you, Shepard. My geth were utterly convinced the Salarians were the real threat. An impressive diversion. Of course, it was all for nothing. I can't let you disrupt what I've accomplished here. You can't possibly understand what's really at stake. So, so tell me, why do I look so worried? I'm on his level now, and I have two teammates with me. Why are you doing this? You've seen the vision from the beacon, Shepard. You of all people should understand what the Reapers are capable of. They cannot be stopped. Do not mire yourself in pointless revolt. Do not sacrifice everything for the sake of petty freedoms. The Protheans tried to fight, and they were utterly destroyed. Trillions dead, but what if they had bowed before the invaders? Would the Protheans still exist? A submission not preferable to extinction? It's not that simple. I'm going to win. Do you really believe the Reapers will let us live? Now you see why I never came forward with this to the Council. We organics are driven by emotion instead of logic. We will fight even when we know we cannot win. Okay, Mr. Vulcan. But if we work with the Reapers, if we make ourselves useful, think how many lives can be spared. Not yours. Once I understood this, I joined Sovereign. Though I was aware of the dangers, I had hoped this facility could protect me. Let's be a little sarcastic about this. You're afraid Sovereign is influencing you. You're afraid he's controlling your thoughts. That wasn't sarcastic at all. I've studied the effects of indoctrination. The more control Sovereign exerts, the less capable the subject becomes. That is my saving grace. The Sovereign needs me to find the conduit. My mind is still my own. For now. But the transformation from ally to servant can be subtle. I will not let it happen to me. Oh yeah, it has already happened. Let's talk about the Geth a little bit here. Why are the Geth following Sovereign? They believe Sovereign to be some kind of god. Understandable. The pinnacle of their own evolution. But the reaction of their deity is most telling. It is insulted. Why? Sovereign does not desire the pitiful devotions the Geth hurl at it. Why not? They are just tools. And no amount of belief on their part will change that. I get it, but still. But as tools, they are useful. They will survive the coming invasion. If organic life is to survive, we must also prove we are useful. We must work with the Reapers. I'm so much better than you that I won't even accept your worship. It, it doesn't necessarily make sense to me. All right, tell me about the conduit. Tell me why Sovereign needs the conduit. Tell me what it is. Maybe we can find a way to stop them. The conduit is the key to your destruction and my salvation. Sovereign needs my help to find it. That is the only reason I have not been indoctrinated. That didn't really answer my question. But you are indoctrinated. Sovereign's manipulating you and you don't even know it. You're already under its power. No, Sovereign needs me. If I find the conduit, I've been promised a reprieve from the inevitable. This is my only hope. Holy shit, join me? There's no way that's gonna work. Come on. Together we can stop Sovereign. We don't have to submit to the Reapers, we can beat them! I no longer believe that, Shepard. Didn't think so. Visions cannot be denied. The Reapers are too powerful. The only hope of survival is to join with them. Sovereign is a machine. It thinks like a machine. If I can prove my value, I become a resource worth maintaining. There is no other logical conclusion. I, I threw it out there. I was trying. I didn't think it was going to work, but I tried. How can you do this? You were a specter. You were sworn to defend the galaxy. Then you broke that vow to save yourself. I'm not doing this for myself. Don't you see? Sovereign will succeed. It is inevitable. My way is the only way any of us will survive. 
I'm forging an alliance between us and the Reapers. Not gonna happen. Between organics and machines. They don't care. And in doing so, I will save more lives than have ever existed. Doubtful. But you would undo my work. You would do our entire civilization to complete annihilation. And for that, you must die. It's about time. Shit. Oh, he gets, he gets a flying machine? What kind of crap is that? Damn it, Liara. Did I get him? Shit. Okay. Throw? Yeah, I figured not. Marksman. Shit, no, no, no. Uh, we'll go with shields first, then marksman. <laughs> Easy. Maybe not. That was an ending. I, I can't believe Caden didn't make it. I can. How could we just leave him down there? Because you were the better option. Yeah, it was you or him. But I'm not going to say that it was you. Yeah, it was, it was indeed for the mission. Like I said, this was purely a business decision. It had nothing to do with the fact that Caden turned down the three-way. Alenko knew the risks going in. He gave his life to save the rest of us. It should have been me, Commander. You know that. It was my decision, yeah. But don't blame yourself. Do you also want to turn down the three-way? You saw what happened to Caden. It wasn't your call, Williams. I had to choose. I chose you. I'm, I'm sorry, Commander. You saved my life. I'm grateful for that. But it should have been me. Alenko was a superior officer. I would have gladly stayed behind. Ash, how far are you going to drive yourself? Are you trying to be a martyr? To redeem your grandfather's honor? That's not fair. It is true, though. What the public and the military did to him was unfair, but I don't want to lose a good soldier over it. Aye, aye, Commander. Commander, excuse me for interrupting, but I have an idea. I think the beacon you found in Saren's base was similar to the one you found on Eden Prime. It may have filled in the missing pieces of your vision. I might be able to help you put all those pieces together. Are we going to do the sexy mind meld thing again? Let's do it. You want to join our minds again, don't you? Okay, go ahead. Here in front of everybody? Relax, Commander. Embrace eternity. I never thought the images would be so intense. I need a moment to collect myself. I'm not going to say that I fully understood that, but hey, at least my forehead thing is back. <laughs> 